Here you are. Today's special. Playhouse pasta. <laughs> My favourite. Miffy, <gasps> Melanie, <gasps> wait until you hear this. What is it, Grunty? <gasps> the, the milk. You like some milk? Here you are. <laughs> We're playing cafes. No, Barbara's shop has run out of milk. Oh, well, that's not very exciting, Grunty. But what is exciting is why there's no milk. Ooh, why? Why? Bella's had a baby. <gasps> I love babies. <laughs> 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 Me too. But who's Bella? I'm not sure, but she's had a baby. We have to go and see. <laughs> Wait, we should take presents for the baby. Maybe we can find something in Barbara's shop, but just not milk. Oh, I know. We can give her some of our old baby things. Good idea. If we like them, maybe the baby will like them too. Let's go and look. <laughs> I haven't heard that in so long. Aren't you a bit old for baby toys? <laughs> it's not for me. I'm looking for something to give a new baby. What a kind idea. Hmm, how about this? You used to love this bottle. OK. Missy! Missy, you there? Coming! <laughs> Oh. Look what I found. Ooh, that's a great present, Miffy. And so is this. Oh, it's so soft and cuddly. It's my old baby blanket. My mum says it looked very cute wrapped up in it. And I played with this when I was a baby. Wow, you were a clever baby, Grunty. No, silly. I just learned this trick last week. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go and find Bella's baby. I can't wait to give the baby a cuddle. Shh, the baby might be sleeping. I'll be really quiet. Tiptoe, tippy toe. Tip -toe, tip -toe. <laughs> <laughs> Hello there, girls. Hi, Farmer John. We've come to visit Bella's baby. <laughs> well, you won't find her in the farmhouse. She's in the barn. The barn? Of course. Best place for her. Come along and I'll show you. Tip -toe, tip -toe. Why is the baby in the barn? I guess we'll find out. Here you are. <gasps> Farmer John, your cow has shrunk. <laughs> no, she hasn't shrunk. Bella is just fine. Aren't you, Bella? Bella's a cow. Oh. So this is Bella's baby. She is indeed. And isn't she a beauty? She's so cute. Oh. <laughs> What's her name? Hmm, she hasn't got one yet. Oh, no. It's OK, Miffy. I'm sure we can think of one. No, it's not that. It's just... <sighs> what is it, Miffy? A baby cow isn't going to like our presents. <sighs> you brought presents? That's jolly kind of you girls. Yes, yeah, but we didn't know it was a baby cow. And baby cows don't like bulls. Or blankets. Or baby bottles. <laughs> I wouldn't be so sure about that, girls. Let me see. Why, this blanket will be just the thing to keep her warm and snug at night. Aww. And she likes her first toy. Oh, so cute. You see? They're perfect presents. Apart from my present, a baby cow doesn't need a baby bottle. <sighs> <laughs> oh, well, I wouldn't be so sure about that, Miffy. The 
really looks very tired. Hardly surprising. Having a baby is tiring work. But it looks to me like her baby might be hungry. I wonder how we might feed her. <gasps> my bottle! We can feed her with my bottle! <laughs> that we can. Ah, oh, look! <laughs> She's so cute! Aww. <laughs> She's giving you a thank you, Nuzzle. Nuzzle! That's it! Well done, Grunty! What for? You found the perfect name for her. Nuzzle! Nuzzle the baby cow! <laughs> Here you go, Nuzzle. <laughs> yes, <laughs> drink up, <laughs> Nuzzle. Hello, Nuzzle. <laughs> Good girl, Snuffy. <laughs> Fetch! <laughs> Hello, Miffy. You're up early. It's the last day of the holidays and I want to spend it all with Snuffy. No stopping, Snuffy. We need to get to school. <laughs> I thought you said it was still the holidays. <laughs> Why are you going to school? The day before school starts, we all help to get it clean and tidy. So it's ready for us. Oh, what a nice idea. <laughs> You're right, Snuffy. We should hurry up. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's Snuffy! And Miffy! Hi, Miffy! Hello, Snuffy! <laughs> That's enough, Snuffy. You have to behave if you're coming to school. Good girl! Teacher's inside, and she's got lots of jobs you can help with. Great! Come on, Snuffy! Hello, Boris. Hello there, Miff. Whoa! Whoops! Hello, Grunty. Hi, Miffy. Hello, Miffy. Oh, and Snuffy. Is it all right if she helps? She won't get in the way. Well, it's not really a school day today, so she can stay if she behaves. Thank you. She'll be good, I promise. Maybe you'd like to help Grunty sort out the pencils while I put these books away. OK. Normal pencils go in this pot and coloured pencils in this one. <laughs> this one needs sharpening. Ooh. Snuffy. Drop it. <laughs> Come back, Snuffy. Whoa, whoa, no. Boris. Boris, are you all right? I am. But my bucket isn't. Snuffy knocked it over. Snuffy did? Are you sure? I saw her. Well, I had my back turned cleaning the windows, but when I heard a splash, I turned round, whoa, whoa, uh, and saw her running off. I'm really sorry, Boris. Snuffy, Snuffy, come back here. <laughs> I'd better fill my bucket up again. I told you, you need to behave if you're going to come to school. Aww. Let's go back inside where I can keep an eye on you. <laughs> la, 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 la. I got your pencil, Grunty. Thanks, Miffy. But I finished sorting the pencils. Teacher said to check the balls next. I have to see if they're bouncy enough. <laughs> She ran through the flowers and messed them all up. That doesn't sound like Snuffy. But we saw her, Miffy. <laughs> you naughty dog, Snuffy. <laughs> I'm sure she didn't mean it, but we did work hard on those flowers. Miffy, it's lovely that Snuffy wants to help, but you must keep her under control. She's normally such a good girl. I'll keep a really close eye on her. Come on, Snuffy. Oh, no.
Snuffy. Huh? Snuffy knocked over all the pencils and ran out of the room. But she can't have done. She was right next to me. <laughs> well, who did do it then? Snuffy! Huh? No! What is going on? Snuffy grabbed my sponge. She didn't. She was inside with us. Snuffy! Huh? <laughs> Snuffy, come back here! <laughs> 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 Two Snuffies? Oh, goodness me! I wonder who that other dog is. <laughs> Excuse me. Has anyone seen my dog? He ran this way, I think. <laughs> I think we have. He went that way. <laughs> Down, Biscuit. Down, boy. Oh, he gets so excited. I hope he's not been too much bother. Oh, nothing we can't sort out. I'm just glad we cleared up the confusion. Come on, Biscuit. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye, Biscuit. Bye-bye, Biscuit. My sponge. Thank you, Snuffy. I'm sorry I blamed you, Snuffy. Me too. Sorry, Snuffy. Yes, we're all sorry, Snuffy. <laughs> I think she's forgiven us. Right. We'd better get a move on if we're going to have everything clean by tomorrow. Can Snuffy come to school every day, miss? Um, I think she's quite clever enough already, don't you? Yes, she is. Good girl, Snuffy! <laughs> <laughs> Good girl, Snuffy! Good Snuffy! <laughs> there. Just right for Christmas. Good morning, Miffy. You're looking very smart. Yes. It's Christmas and we're having a special dinner. I can't wait. Aunt Alice is coming. Miffy, time to open your present. Oh, yay! I love presents. Oh, I've got one too. <laughs> Maybe it's a tennis racket or a piano. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, it's not big enough to be a piano. <laughs> What do you think it is, then? <laughs> Why don't you open it and find out? Good idea. A box of chocolates. Oh, that was going to be my next guess. <laughs> and I've got a book. Lovely. And this is your present, Miffy. <laughs> animal Adventures? I love this game. You pretend to be an animal and everybody else has to guess what you are. Can we play now? Can we? Please? Well, oh, go on then, Miffy. Break open the box. I hope I get to be a monkey. <laughs> 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 I need to go and pick up Aunt Alice. Uh, don't worry. You can leave us playing animal adventures. No, I can't. Someone needs to keep an eye on the nut roast. And then there's the table to lay. Oh, we can take care of all that. Right, Miffy? But I really want to play my new game. OK. We'll have one quick game and then we'll do our jobs. Yeah! All right, one quick game. Right, Daddy, can you guess what I am? Woof, woof. <laughs> woof, woof. You're an elephant. <laughs> no, wait, uh, a giraffe. No. <laughs> oh. Woof, woof. oh, no, you're a dog. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> woof. <laughs> right, my turn. Um. <laughs> Oh, I am hungry. It wouldn't be Christmas without nut roast. Everything should be ready and waiting for us. <laughs> <laughs> Aunt Alice! Mummy! You're back already? Have you been playing all this time? Oh, you've only been gone. <gasps> Longer than I thought. Oops. The table hasn't been laid and... What's that smell? Uh-oh. Oh, the nut roast is ruined. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh, we lost track of time. It wasn't all Daddy's fault. I was playing, too. What are we going to do for Christmas dinner now? Oh, don't worry. I'm sure we can find something. Oh. Uh, 
Um. Huh. Hello, Missy. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Grunty. You don't sound very merry. Why didn't you come for a ride on my new sledge? Sorry, Grunty. I don't think anything is going to cheer me up today. What's the matter? Daddy and I were supposed to be looking after dinner, but we got a bit carried away playing animal adventures. Oh, I love that game. Moo! Moo! We played for so long, we forgot to lay the table. And our nut roast got burnt while Mummy was fetching Aunt Alice. Oh no, that's a shame. But you've got your family with you. That's nice. You're right, Grunty. It is. Got to go. Talking about dinners made me hungry. Bye. Bye, Grunty. Oh, we could have stewed carrots, I suppose. Well, they're, they're not my favourite. That doesn't matter. It's Christmas Day and we're all together. That's what's most important. You're right, Miffy. It is. Let's lay the table together. Having lots of fun on Christmas Day. Songs to sing and games to play. Party hats and crackers, family too. Sharing a special day with you. everybody. This looks splendid. Not quite a nut roast, but it'll do. I'll get it. Merry Christmas, Miffy! Poppy, Grunty, what are you doing here? I told Aunt Poppy all about what happened to your Christmas dinner. And I said we can't have our friends missing out on a nut roast, so I thought we'd come and share ours. Wow! Are you sure, Poppy? It's very kind of you. Of course. I always make too much. <laughs> Is there room for two more? <laughs> There's always room for friends. Having lots of fun on Christmas Day. Songs to sing and games to play. Present and snow and lots of treats. And all the tastiest food to eat. Together with our friends and family too. Sharing a special day with you. Sharing a special Christmas day with you. <laughs> Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas everybody! <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody! Oh, come on! Where could they be? Oh, here they are! Quick, you don't want to miss the beginning! <laughs> he did it! Here. Oh, How exciting! But what if I don't get it right? You were great in practice. You just need to relax. You can do it, Grunty. I'll be standing right next to you. Thanks, Miffy. That helps. Oh, yes, thank you, Miffy. But you should go and get ready. It's nearly time to start. Yay! <laughs> thank you. My class have worked very hard to put together a special song for you. So, without further ado, take it away, Aunt Alice. When I grow up, what sort of job will I do? So many things that I could be, so many things I could choose. I could be a doctor making everyone well. I could be a fireman and ring the fire bell. I could be a singer, write a song every day. I could be a chef with my very own cafe. What will I be when I grow up? What sort of job will I do? So many things that I could be So many things I could choose I could be a farmer with animals and crops Sending milk and vegetables to all the local shops <laughs> I could be a pilot flying up in the sky 
Everyone will wait for me as I go by. <laughs> could be a carpenter and make things out of wood From kitchen chairs to fixing stairs I'd do a lot of good I love to make things all day long Sometimes Melanie gets it wrong <laughs> <laughs> I could be an artist making works of art Picture stories, music, whatever's in my heart But whatever I choose to be, I'll still be me What will I be when I grow up? What sort of job will I do? So many things that I could be So many things I could choose So many things to be, it seems the only Overtake the leader of the pack But whatever I choose to be I'll still be me If I was a detective I'd go solving mysteries <gasps> Looking everywhere for clues And catching crooks like these But whatever I choose to be I'll still be me Team, to score a goal and win the match, less that would be my dream. But whatever I choose to be, I'll still be me. I could be an astronaut and fly up into space. I travel far among the stars, it's such a thrilling place. No matter what the future holds, we'll take a leap. Be brave, be bold. Here goes. Oh. <gasps> Sometimes things can go wrong, but we don't have to stop our song. Everybody! What will I be when I grow up? What sort of job will I do? So many things that I could be, so many things I could choose. It's fun to play, but don't forget, we don't have to decide just yet. And whatever I choose to be, I'll still be me. I liked it when Grunty pretended to fall over. <laughs> <laughs> well, I saw what happened, Miffy. You were very kind to Grunty. I only did what I saw a teacher doing earlier. She's always kind and helpful. <laughs> so, Miffy, have you decided what you want to be when you grow up? Actually, yes. I want to be a teacher, just like you. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Miffy. Playhouse! Playhouse! <laughs> 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 sit! Snuffy, sit! Sit! Well done, Snuffy! What are you up to, Miffy? I'm training Snuffy for the pet talent show. We're going to do an obstacle course. Watch! Come on, Snuffy! <laughs> Is it going well? Um, sort of. Over, Snuffy. <laughs> no, over is like this. <laughs> well done, Snuffy. She likes following me. Come on, Snuffy. You can follow me all the way to the pet show. <laughs> um, a yellow one, please. Here you go. Thank you. <laughs> la, 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 la. <laughs> Ooh! Can 
I have a carrot burger, please, Pompey? Uh, not yet, Grunty. I've only just put them on. They won't be ready for a while. <laughs> oh, 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 and no carrot burgers for you, Snuffy. <laughs> it's starting. Come on, Snuffy, it's starting. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the event you've all been waiting for. The Pet Talent Show. First up is Dan and Bubbles. Bubbles is going to sing for you. Oh. A singing fish? Don't be silly. Fishy. Well done, Bubbles. And Dan, too, of course. You've won a medal. Yes. Look, Snuffy. We could win a medal. And now, let's welcome Boris and Lightning. Lightning is a detective. A detective, eh? Well, I've never met a tortoise detective before. Can you please cover Lightning's eyes while I hide this piece of lettuce? So... Detective Lightning, where's the lettuce? Go on, Lightning. Oh! Oh, oh wow. look at that! That was so clever! Well done, Lightning. You're the best tortoise detective I've ever seen. Go oh, on, Boris. Well done, Lightning. And now, please welcome Miffy and Snuffy! Go, Miffy and Snuffy! Oh, oh, I've got to see this. Come on, Snuffy. <laughs> Snuffy, sit. Round. <laughs> Good girl, Snuffy. Yay, Snuffy. Oh, no. Now, over, Snuffy. <laughs> Come oh. back, Snuffy. Oh, no. Oh, uh, well, thank you, Miffy and Snuffy. Now, uh, uh, who's this? I'm Melanie. And this is Peanuts the Parrot Poet. I'll show you. One, two, three. Oh, have a cup of tea. Climb a tree. Have a cup of tea. Wow. <laughs> Snuffy, come back and try again. <laughs> oh. oh, Snuffy will never win a medal. <sighs> Huh? <gasps> <gasps> oh, yes. You did the course best when you were copying me. Perhaps we can win a medal after all. Come on, Snuffy. <laughs> you and me? Oh, have a cup of tea. <laughs> <laughs> Peanut the Poet Parrot, you've won a medal. Oh, thank you very much. Perhaps you'd prefer a cup of tea. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Pilot. Hello, Miffy. Does Snuffy want to take part after all? Yes. Can we try again? You most certainly can. Hooray! <laughs> Whoa, <Hooray! Yay! laughs> Snuffy, sit. Good girl. Now come round. <laughs> Over. Ha. Snuffy? Over! Over, Snuffy! <laughs> Snuffy! Oh, smells like something's burning. <gasps> oh, no! My carrot burger! Oh, I'm sorry. I was so busy watching the pet show, I forgot all about the burgers. It's a good job Snuffy didn't. Yes, she prevented a fire. Well done, Snuffy. <laughs> Yay, Snuffy! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, time for the final presentation. I'm afraid we can't give Snuffy a medal for the obstacle course because she didn't finish it. <laughs> However, I am pleased to award her this special medal for being a brilliant fire dog. <laughs> well done, Snuffy. <laughs> well done, Snuffy. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, hello, Miffy. Looking for something? It's show and tell day at school. Teacher asked us to bring in something special. So you're taking in a box? <laughs> no, the box isn't special. It's where I keep all my special things. Like this. Oh, your toy boat. That is special. Yes. Hmm. But I took this in last show and tell. I need to find something different. <gasps> your umbrella. Good idea, Miffy. It's perfect. Miffy! Melanie's here. Brilliant! I'm in here, Melanie! Look, Miffy, look! I'm taking my umbrella in for show and tell. Oh, but so am I. But we can't both take umbrellas. You're right. Don't worry, I'll find something else. There are lots of things in my box. Oh, yes! What about this? <gasps> my special feather! Uncle Pilot brought it back from far away. It's a tickle feather, see? <laughs> so it is. <laughs> you should <laughs> definitely bring your feather in. But it's so delicate, I don't usually take it out of the box. It'll be okay if you hold onto it really tightly, and teacher would love to see it. Okay, I'll take it. Come on, we don't want to be late. Hi, Grunty. Hi, Melanie. Look how special my special thing is. Ta-da! It's lovely. But I hope it doesn't rain. <laughs> <laughs> Where's your special thing, Grunty? Here. Ta-da! Oh, Grunty, it's a stick. It's not just any old stick. It's my twirling stick. Look! Hup. Oh, wow, great wow. twirling, Grunty. <gasps> oh, no, my feather. Oh, no. Oh, don't worry. I'll get it down. I can't reach it. Maybe I can get the feather down with my twirling stick. No, Grunty. We don't want your stick getting stuck, too. Look! Mrs Bird, please can you give back Miffy's feather? <gasps> oh, no! Oh, no! My feather! It's gone! <sighs> Morning! I can't wait for show and tell today. What's the matter? Miffy's special thing just flew away. Oh, that's a shame. What is that? I'll show you. And tell you later. <laughs> Morning, children. I thought as it's such a lovely day, we could do show and tell outside for a change. Yay! Hooray! Hooray! Yay! Everything okay, Miffy? Not really. My special thing just flew away. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Why don't you come and sit with me and see what the others have brought? It might make you feel better. Now, Dan, why don't you go first? OK. <clears throat> my show-and-tell has been in my family for over a hundred years. Oh. Ooh. I love it. It's very old. And it's very long. Ooh. If you look through it, you can see things far, far away. <gasps> Miffy, what is it? I know. I can do my show and tell after all. You can? Yes. Can I use your telescope again, please, Dan? Of course you can, Miffy. Thanks. We need it to look all the way up there. Look! It's your special.
special feather. <laughs> I see it. Oh, how wonderful. Such lovely colours. It's thanks to your telescope that I found it. Oh, I'm happy it's being used. It's usually stuck in an old box. So is my feather. I'm glad it's being used to make Mrs Bird's nest comfy. Ooh. And me! Wow! I've never seen a bird with two heads before. Huh? <laughs> it's not a two-headed bird, Gwenty. Mrs Bird has had a chick. Oh, yes! So cute! Chirp, 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 chirpity chirp. Whoa! A giant ladybird! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Melanie! Oh, home at last. I never thought we'd get back from the shops. Driving in snow is really tricky. And snow. <laughs> Ooh. Look! Someone came to the house while we were out shopping. Ooh, how do you know? Footprints! Look! Oh, so there are. I wonder who they belong to. Hmm. They're almost the same size as mine. It must have been one of my friends. Oh, this might help us figure out who was here. Look what I found slipped under the door. It's a Christmas card from Granty. These are her footprints. Mystery solved. <laughs> right, inside Miffy. Oh, it's freezing out here. Hey, where are you off to now? I've got a card to give to Granty. But she could be anywhere. I don't know where Granty is, but her footprints do. I just have to follow them. Aha! Grunty! Grunty! Missy! Thanks for your card, Grunty. I wanted to give you mine. Oh, thanks, Miffy. But how did you know I'd be in the library? I followed your footprints in the snow. It was fun. Wow! Can I play? I'll follow your footprints. Oh, wait. You're already here. <laughs> you can't follow mine, Grunty. <gasps> but we can follow those. Hmm. They're quite small. Who do you think left them? Only one way to find out. <laughs> They go to the playhouse. Maybe they're Dan's. Hmm, they're too small for Dan. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Nothing! <laughs> <laughs> Look, new footprints. Oh. Ooh. I wonder who they belong to. They're the smallest ones yet. Oh. <laughs> Where did they go? <whistles> They're his footprints. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Robin. We can't follow you up there. Wow. Look at this one, Miffy. It's really big. What would make that funny swishy line? Maybe it's a snake or the tail of a monster. A snow monster! Bronte, there's no such thing as snow monsters. Let's follow the trail and find out what it really is. Uh, okay. <gasps> Miffy, what? Shh, listen. It's a snow monster! Oh, bother! <laughs> That's not a snow monster! It's Boris! Huh? Boris! You're not a snow monster! Oh, I should hope not! 
I'm trying to get this Christmas tree home. But it's heavier than I expected. That's strange. Trail is where you're dragging the tree. Here, we'll help you. Oh, thanks, girls. That'd be great. One, One two, two, three. three heave! heave. Oh. I knew there was no such thing as snow monsters. <laughs> <laughs> That'll give someone a surprise. Come on, it'll be easy from here. There! Perfect! <sighs> and not a moment too soon. Hey, would you like to help me decorate the tree before Barbara gets home? Yes, yes please! Yoo-hoo! Hanging baubles on the tree Lots of fun for Miffy and me Some go high, some go low whoa, Careful, whoa, Boris whoa, whoa. Take it slow Yeah, all done Boris, is that you? <gasps> Just in time, quick Boris? Surprise! Surprise! Oh, it's wonderful What a lovely surprise there's just one last thing to do. Miffy? Yes! <gasps> oh. I'm glad we followed the footprints, Miffy. Yes, you never know where they might take you. Well, you haven't followed my footprints yet, but I suggest you do. Why? Because they're heading to the kitchen for hot chocolate. Yippee! Hot chocolate, my favourite! Bye! <laughs> See you tomorrow! Yeah, bye! Oh, don't forget, it's sports day tomorrow. Oh, our first sports day? It sounds exciting! Oh, it is! There's a special obstacle course where you have to be good at running, jumping and balancing too. Don't forget throwing. Will there be prizes? Of course! If you can do all the obstacles, you get a certificate. Oh, wow! wow. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Bye! I think we should go and have one last practice before sports day. We can practice together at the playground. Grace you! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Dan! Sorry, I'm not very good at running. Don't worry, Dan. Running is just one bit of sports day. I'm sure you'll be good at the other bits. Come on. On sports day, you have to do jumping like this. Hup, 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 hup. So that looks like fun. My turn. Uh, well done. Hup. I'm just not very good at jumping. But you are brilliant at running. And there'll be other things you'll be good at too. How about balancing? That's my favourite. Watch! <laughs> now you try. <laughs> wow! Oh, I'm not sure. I'm feeling a bit wobbly. Don't worry, Grunty. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, there. <laughs> Only one more thing to practice. Throwing. Oh, I've got a ball in my bag. Let's see who can throw it the furthest. I'll go first. <laughs> Whoa, good throw, Grunty. <laughs> Catch. Let's see if I can beat it. <laughs> yes. Oh, I'm not good at throwing. I wasn't very good at running. Balancing was really hard. And jumping made me fall over. Maybe we should play something else for a little while. How about Nice and Dragons? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> 
I'll be Grunty the Knight. I'm Miffy the Bold. I can be Brave Sir Dan. Quick! The dragon's coming! Run! <laughs> Look out! <laughs> Wait! I thought we were practicing for sports day. Let's just play for a little bit first. It'll cheer us up. You could be Melanie the Magical. Hmm. The wisest wizard of them all. <laughs> Spellball! Whoosh! <laughs> Good spell, Melanie the Magical. Look out! <laughs> Dragon! Here he comes! <laughs> Spellball! Whoosh! Look out! <laughs> <laughs> you don't scare me, Dragon! <laughs> <laughs> First, you have to balance on the beam. Then you have to run as fast as you can to the ball and throw it in the hoop. Once you've done that, you hop into the rings and cross the finishing line. Doesn't it look like fun? Hmm. What's the matter? I thought you were all looking forward to sports day. We were, but our practice didn't go very well yesterday. But you've been doing sports all year. You're all brilliant. But not at everything. I wasn't very good at throwing. And I'm not a very fast runner. I'm not sure I want to do sports day. Knights and Dragons was much more fun. Oh, maybe we can make sports day more like Knights and Dragons. Come on, Grunty the Knight. There's a dragon on the loose. Look <laughs> 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 out. Be careful in the crumbling cliff oh. bar. I think we need a spell ball, Melanie the Magical. Spell ball, whoosh! Yeah! Spell ball! <laughs> Don't forget me! Race her down to the rescue! Oh, goodness! Mm. I thought you didn't want to do sports day. We didn't! But you're doing all the obstacles. <laughs> That's because we're playing dragons and knights. <laughs> we were worried about doing the obstacles, so we turned it into a game instead. It's fun! <laughs> what a good idea, Miffy. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> this way! <laughs> now run as fast as you can <laughs> through the forest of spooky <laughs> trees. Don't let the prickly branches grab you. Spell ball! Whoosh! Woohoo! <laughs> Yay! Quick, hop onto these marshmallows. We need to get across the swamp of melted chocolate. Nearly <laughs> there. Race to the castle. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Grunty the Knight, and all of your brave friends. Here are your rewards. Yay! <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Woohoo! Can we do it again? I don't see why not, but this time, uh, can I be the dragon? Here comes the dragon! This way! Run! Look out! Are you still awake, Miffy? Oh, yes. And how did you enjoy your first trip to the ballet? It was lovely. The ballerinas' dresses were so twinkly and sparkly. Just like the stars. <laughs> You're right, Miffy. And look how bright the moon is tonight. I'll keep my eyes on the ground if you two don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> Good thinking. All right, stargazers, here we are. Home again. Hello. What's that? It's a star! A star fell out of the sky! Whatever it is, it's very bright. Hello there! Huh? Oh, I know that voice. <gasps> That's no star. Uncle Pilot! You're up late. Well, it's such a clear night. I thought you might want to look at the stars. <laughs> I am looking. That's a really twinkly one. Twinkle, little star. Twinkle. See? Oh, yes. Well spotted, Miffy. But I thought you and me could have a closer look at them. <gasps> I've got a surprise to show you. Oh, if that's OK with you, of course. Can I? Please? I think that would be all right. It's the weekend tomorrow, so you can have a bit of a lie-in. <gasps> Thanks, Mummy. Just pop this on in case it gets chilly. OK. Come on, Miffy. We've got stars to see. Bye. Have fun. Oh, I know 
know what we're doing. We're climbing up so we can be closer to the stars. Uh, that's a good guess, Miffy. But I can do better than that. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> oh, wow! I set up my telescope. Come and have a look. They're so bright. And if I point it over here... My twinkly star! Twinkle, twinkle, great big star. Oh, yes. Very nice. Can we look at the moon? We certainly can. There. <gasps> the moon's so big. I could almost reach out and touch it. Thank you, Uncle Pilot. This is the best treat ever. <sighs> well, maybe we should get you home now. It's getting late. Not yet. I'm not tired. <gasps> Look. It's a shooting star. Well done, Miffy. That's good luck. Oh, it's coming this way. Can I see? <gasps> it fell out of the sky. It must have landed near here. I'm not sure, Miffy. That's very unlikely. No, I saw it. I saw it fall. <gasps> there! Huh? Really? Really! I can see it shining. Let's go and find it. Wait for me! What here? We've looked all over, Miffy, and it's getting late. Maybe we should call it a night, eh? No, I saw something shining. We were up there, and I saw something shining down here. From up there? Hmm. <laughs> I wonder. You don't believe me. Hey? Of course I believe you, Miffy. If you say you saw it, that's good enough for me. And I reckon if we get ourselves high up, we might see it again. <gasps> Back to the telescope! Oh, 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 I think we can do better than that. Whee! <laughs> Welcome to the stars, Miffy! Wow, this is beautiful! Take a look down there, Miffy! What I saw! It's not a star, it's the moon! The moon fell in the pond! It's just the moon's reflection in that pond, Miffy! And a good thing too! But you were right! You did see something shining down there! I knew it! It's so pretty! So pretty! Miffy! You alright back there? Fast asleep and dreaming of the stars, eh? <sighs> Let's get you home. Hello, Miffy. What a pretty tune. It's for the Midwinter Festival. I'm playing in the Midwinter Band. I'm off to get Grunty. <laughs> Have fun, Miffy. There. My hot chocolate will keep you nice and warm at the festival. Mmm. That'll be Miffy. I'll get it. <laughs> Hi, Poppy. Hello, Miffy. Ready for the festival? Of course we are. We've been practising our tune lots. Oh, maybe you can give me a sneak preview while I pack up these biscuits. Of course. <laughs> Oh, wonderful! 
You should hear it when Melanie and Dan join in. And wait till you see Barbara's beautiful ice dance. <laughs> 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 oh, no! Is it all right? <laughs> I think it's broken. <gasps> oh, no! Maybe you could play something else. Like what? I'm only good at the tuba because I'm good at huffing and puffing. Well, the mouthpiece is all right. Maybe we can find something else for you to huff and puff into. Aha! What about this? You can put the mouthpiece at this end and then you can huff and puff it. <laughs> <laughs> Winter Festival after all! And it tastes a bit chocolatey. <laughs> Let's go! I wish I could skate like Barbara. She's so graceful. And that's how you have to play. Gracefully. So our music matches the skating. <laughs> um, Grunty, where's your tuba? It broke. I'm playing the funnel trumpet instead. Right. Well, let's see. <laughs> Grunty, do you think you could play a bit more quietly? I don't think I can. But we have to play gracefully to match the skating. Oh. Don't worry, Grunty. I'm sure there's something we can do. Miffy's right. We'll think of something. So, who's for a biscuit? Yes, Me, please. Thanks, Ooh. Poppy. Thank you. <sighs> Don't worry, Grunty. We'll find a way to have you in the band. <laughs> there, all gone. I know. If the funnel doesn't fit the band, maybe we can make the band fit the funnel. <laughs> Whatever do you mean? Well, if Grundy has a homemade instrument, maybe we should all have homemade instruments. This could be my drum. See? That might just work, Miffy. What else can we use? My pencil tin can be a shaker. And these rubber bands with my lunchbox can make a guitar. And I can play my trumpet. <laughs> <laughs> We're the homemade band. And don't you sound funny? I wonder what Barbara will make of this. Yay! <laughs> One, two, three, one. <laughs> oh, my! Oh, I'm sorry, Barbara. It's the best we could do. I broke my tuba and I had to do something about it. <laughs> Don't worry. I love it. It sounds so fun. The problem is my dance doesn't match the music anymore. Barbara's right. Her dancing is all swooshy and swishy, but our music's all barby. <laughs> we can soon fix that. You've made up new instruments, so I'll make up a new dance to match. A grand idea! One, two, three, one. <laughs> And the homemade band! 